Welcome back everyone to my let's play. My name is Perno King and you're watching this episode of playing Pokemon Red. And I will show you guys. And uh, while I was training my Dratini, it evolved into a Dragonair. And yeah, I'm quite happy with that. And the other thing you can see is that I left my gloom behind for this gym challenge. And uh, I also found out what was happening with my money, which you can see over here. Look, it keeps refreshing to nine 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 nine, and uh, somehow nine 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 Zenny cheat has activated. Um, I keep disabling it, but it keeps going. So yeah, I'm just going to treat it as not there. Because uh, I can't really do anything about it, yeah, restart the entire let's play. Um, or find a new emulator, only... <laughs> uh, this is the only emulator so far I've found which allows me to record with fraps. So, yeah, I'm just gonna go ahead and assume I have about 10,000 right now. And uh, work from there. And as you can see, my vicious Dragonair is quite effective in this gym. Because I told him uh, Ice Beam. And I'm really bummed about the fact that it, uh, that cheat activated. Because now I have a feeling like I did something really wrong. Uh, while I have no idea what it might be that I did. So yeah, I'm just not going to think about that anymore. Oh, this is getting annoying. I have a paralyzed seal. I'd much rather have poison. But yeah, it's quite annoying. I found the cheat. It's actually in a long list of cheats that's built into the ROM. And it somehow won't deactivate for me. Uh, maybe I do uh, maybe I'm doing something wrong, maybe I'm not. Nah. At least it's quite frustrating. I I'll give it that. However, that's not why we're doing this. And there was also uh, the cheat. There was another cheat on that said uh, um, multiple master balls or anything. And I checked my inventory, and I can show you guys that uh, I don't have those. If you'd like, um, and you can say well, you trashed them and you threw them away. And it's the same sort of cheat as the infant money cheat, so it would regenerate each time I open the menu. So. Or buy something, or or try to catch anything. And let's see. Uh, this one will die as well. I'll show you guys. There is no master ball here. So that rules out that option. So that cheat does deactivate, and it doesn't give anything when you deactivate it, however, this one does. So I'm just going to buy whatever I, do, whatever I want, uh, which is not much until I get to the Elite Four, which I'm, where I'm going to buy potions and such, and apart from that I'm not going to use any more money, I think. Or not a whole lot, maybe buying some revives and stuff but that's about it so generally speaking at the end of the playthrough you'd have about uh, 43,000 I think so 
so if I'm if I'm at the end, uh, I will just buy uh, 50 revives and 50 uh, hyper potions or max potions, whatever I can buy, and I'll just call it that, and then I'm broke. And I'll try to see if I can find anything else uh, to turn it off again, because this is really not funny. Not funny at all. And there you can see it leveled up again. I love using this Pokemon. It's strong and it looks cool. And for those of you wondering, no, I am not gonna use my War Turtle here unless absolutely necessary. But I don't foresee that much problem. Of that much problems with this. Oh, well, well, you know what the heck. To make up, I will use my War Turtle. And I can't remember if I did or did not. <sighs> just now. Uh, Press fast forward. I don't think I did. At least I shouldn't have. As far as I know. But we'll see. Oh, this was a really dumb idea. I have a feeling this is gonna come back and bite me in the ass. Okay, I'm not taking on a gloom with my however strong war turtle. And as you may have not noticed, I haven't bought any potions yet. <coughs> I used uh, only the two that I found. And that was the case with most things. The only thing I bought was five paradise heals, uh, five antidotes and some pokeballs so far. So yeah, it's coming along pretty nice. Oh, I'll give you another dose. <sighs> Dumb. I thought she wouldn't trigger until I was in front of a plant or something. Oh yeah, I like this Pokemon a lot too, or mainly its uh, evolution, just because it, it sounds funny. Okay, I'm gonna fast forward the sleep bit. Because this can take a while. There we go. And I'm sorry about cutting out all the grinding and stuff. If you guys ha would have liked to see that. But. Uh, all that grinding takes up a lot of time. And. Arc. Um, that's just not worth it. It would mean this uh, entire Let's Play would have been extended by at least 24 episodes or something with just grinding, uh, and that's no fun. This runt of a Pokemon is destroying my War Turtle. Says volumes about how annoying sleep is in this game. Well, at least I got to level 33. Uh, let's see. I'm going. Oh no, I don't have to back out. I was just playing around with uh, my war turtle. At least I don't know if I have to back out to heal my freaking Pokemon. Because that would suck donkey bells. And uh, I'm thinking of putting this everything up till now up at once. 
just for shits and giggles, sort of say. But yeah, I mainly want to do that for one sole reason, is that I get qu a lot of content up in a very short time. Uh, yes, let's use my pitch order for this because I'm seated. And that means you can watch a couple of episodes right after each other. And I don't have to really hurry up with the rest, at least not for the next couple of days. So that gives me time to work on my Minecraft Let's Play, my Creative Let's Play, and also uh, I'm working on the Diablo Let's Play of my single player. Which is coming along at a steady pace, but uh, I have a uh, few quests that I uh, finished already in that Let's Play, so I just have to edit it and I have to force myself to start editing those things because that's going to take a lot of time because uh, one quest is about one hour and I have to find nice points to cut it off and render them and upload them and make descriptions and I have to do everything for it yet and I want to get that done first at least uh, the descriptions, the tags, uh, the titles yes, wrap me so uh, it might be a little while before uh, that hits the airwaves or the web waves or the internet however you may want to call it but rest assured I am working on it It's just not really that easy to do everything that I want to do and have a job at the same time, full time job, and everything else. And now let's go ahead and kick butt in Saladin Gym. Yeah, she's a whiny little one. Uh, that reminds me of Pokemon episodes, the early ones. The victory bell of James. Oh, damn, that was funny. It set a trend and then it continued into late series. But victory bell and coughing and Ekans and Meowth are just classic ones. Well, Meowth is still there, but the, uh, the coughing Ekans or wheezing and Arbok. Uh, those were the ones who were memorable because they were the first ones. Same with this vic uh, with James Victory Bell. I really like uh, the character of the Victory Bell. It's really uh, strange to say because uh, it's a Pokemon and it's an animated character, but it had a personality that differed from all the others, and since then it's only been rinsed and repeated. Which I found kind of. S it was too bad because uh, they should have given all the. Uh, yeah, comic relief uh, Pokemon of James. Uh, more differing personalities. I mean, his Cacnea was quite possibly the same character as his Victory Bell and I think later on he gets another kind of grass type that has also th that also has the same personality and uh, it's just it's too bad it had more potential than they really let them have oh. this is one annoying move Not as annoying as sleep, but it does hard hardly any damage right now, and it just serves to pisses me off quite generously. And 
I'm gonna make short work of this vile plume. Enough playing around. As you can see, this gym is already up to level 29, so it doesn't differ that much from my Pokémon. And apparently, this vile plume had the same idea as me to not take it easy anymore, but somehow I managed. And that was this gym. So, I think uh, I will uh, stop the episode right here. Uh, next episode will be about, or the next few episodes, because I think it's going to take a few, is about the uh, game corner which is also a rocket hideout and I need to clear that to be able to get the self scope I think it was called so I will heal up my Pokemon and I will see you at the next episode if you like this episode please leave a like and if you have any suggestions or tips, write them in the comments, I will look at them. And if you really like my videos and you want to see more, and want to be updated as soon as I post them, please subscribe to my channel, it would also mean a lot to me. And well, for now, I will say good night and enjoy your day if you still have one. This is Spurno King signing out.